is up guys this is Alex and today we're gonna be discussing reasons not to buy an Apple watch reason number one don't buy an Apple watch if you think that there are lots of medical stuff packed into this watch because there are actually just a few of them first one is the heart rate monitor okay we have it just on any other watch like Samsung like LG G watch or any other watch it's normal would you really pay that amount of money for just a heart rate sensor and the same, just maybe a little bit different design? Apple made the Apple Watch a disappointment at the medical industry because of this lack of sensors. And maybe Apple will sell some uh, adapters or some medical stuff later attached to the Apple Watch, but as a product I wouldn't ever buy this for the medical stuff for some medicine or sports I'd better choose any other watch available in the market for even less price so the Apple watch is so freaking expensive the price is between $350 and $17,000 can you imagine such a watch for $17,000 in case this is Rolex or something else I think you should guys think about buying this Rolex or something else instead of the Apple Watch. Okay, maybe materials are really best quality and I know it's gold, it's sapphire crystal glass. But you know, uh, the technology is developing and it doesn't actually cost like this. The real cost for this watch is about, for the gold edition I mean, is a thousand dollars maximum. Reason number two, this is battery. Well, the battery is not really nice, but I think that could pack something more than just a regular battery for one day. Because I have these guys here, and you know, this is the Galaxy Gear and Samsung Galaxy S4, so they paired just like the iPhone with this Apple Watch. And you know what? On this Galaxy, it's the same battery, like the one day, maybe two days, depends. So, I'd better buy this one instead of... Apple Watch. Reason number three, wait for the second generation of the Apple Watch. So some people in the web say that the next generation of this watch will be much much better, it would have the two days battery time and another S2 processor and currently we have the S1 processor so that's the difference and it maybe have some new features and some uh, advantages so just wait for the second generation of this watch. Okay, another reason for not buying an Apple Watch. This is fitness tracking. Well, I have fitness tracking on my Jailbone app device, and it's basically the same I get on the Apple Watch. There are the same sensors, the third generation of the Jailbone band has just the same capabilities as the Apple Watch and the Fitbit, and many other of these bands can do the same as the Apple Watch. So if you want not to have the watch but just the fitness tracker just buy a Fitbit or something like this because it's gonna be more efficient and you'll spend much less money anyway guys we will see how the Apple watch will be selling in a little while and thanks everyone for watching hope you enjoyed my video please hit that like button if you like this video and subscribe to my channel for the future updates and I'll catch you guys later peace